Hey guys, Steve here from Top Guns out of Terre Haute, Indiana with take three on this specific video. I'm here with Ryan from Top Guns out of, you're not from Top Guns. I'm from Trijicon. You're from Trijicon. I'm from Top Guns. All right, so we're going to take a look today at which optic? So we're going to be looking at the MRO HD, which is the most recent addition to our rifle reflex line. Uh, so the MRO has been extremely popular since we launched it. Um, we have a standard red dot, we have a green dot, uh, but one of the things that we kept getting requests for was uh, compatibility with a magnifier mm -hmm. as well as a complex reticle. So we achieved that in the MRO HD design um, and we also launched a uh, no magnifier barrel. with it. So it's going to be the similar housing design, so it's going to be a four. Do I look really cool design. when I do that? Do I look cool like if I hold it like that? No, okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. No, Go you're ahead. good. All right. Uh, so it's going to be forged uh, forged aluminum housing, uh, ambidextrous brightness controls, sub-flush adjusters similar to the standard MRO, uh, but it will have an upgraded lens design, so it's going to be a much crisper dot, and it's also going to allow for a full reticle in there as well. So if somebody wants that functionality of a complex reticle in their red dot, the MRO HD is going to be the direction that they'd want to go. And then we also offer it with a 3x magnifier so people that want that flexibility of having just a standard red dot but with the ability to uh, reach out and identify a lot of uh, magnifiers are used for identification purposes the, the uh, magnifier is a really good option if you don't want to go to a low power barrier. I'm gonna call myself out here I uh, admittedly I have not used a magnifier yeah I kind of like that it's really nice yeah it works well uh, all right so and I, you may have already mentioned this I was playing with the gun yeah. um, Battery life? Battery life is about a year to two years, depending on the brightness setting. Uh, it does diminish a little bit if you use the full complex reticle, just because of how much of the uh, how much is being illuminated. That will drop down a little bit, but it's still a uh, very strong battery life. And the battery is actually located right on top of the optics, so it's a very quick, easy battery change in case uh, you needed to go that route. So if Alex were using it, it would last for like three years because he's not as bright. Is that exactly. what you're saying? Exactly. Okay, got it. All right, guys, don't hesitate to post your questions down below. Hey now, uh, please hit your like, share, subscribe buttons. We will talk to you all soon. Take care.